let's reformat this Lenovo idea pad uh, for idea pad s no idea pad 100 s so you can't reformat your laptop netbook here so what you need to do guys is you need to make a bootable device Windows 10 32-bit remember that Windows 10 32-bit that's the only thing you can boot to this device guys so you need 32-bit Windows 10 which I created here and you can uh, perform that or you can download Windows 10 32-bit 32-bit you can search for Google for that you can use ISO there to create a bootable device Windows 10 32-bit then after that you need to uh, press the novo button here guys not the power um, behind the I mean here that's the no button there and then um, after you press that button you go to first you get to boot BIOS setting set up if you have password then you enter that if not that that's good to go next we go to configuration configuration by using the arrow here and let's go to the secure boot guys you need to turn that off you need to turn that off secure boot turn that off by pressing enter after that you need to press F10 save changes just hit, hit enter and now it, let's turn off again the machine now you insert your windows 10 bootable device here and of course you need to prepare your external external keyboard because it will not work due to driver compatibility I think press again the no you need to power power there press the power and F12 F12 F and F12 maybe there and now you can see that there is now available boot devices for our if I boot boot I mean you press the if I that's your flash drive and you wait there and after you see the screen it will, the keyboard will not function You choose a uh, language or English by no the keyboard will not function so you will use the external keyboard here as you can see you you choose the English enter enter oh just use tabs there tab 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 enter uh, just highlight the install now enter and um, you have to wait uh, there wait for the device to finish and then that's uh, you can choose there uh, you can choose Windows Home the pre-install here is home but I will choose the uh, single language here enter
and there you just press space for your keyboard external and enter and go to custom below you just highlight below enter and you have to delete this everything here we need to have a fresh fresh uh, window so I prefer deleting this using the tab tab to delete okay we need to delete everything here um, you can scroll uh, there by using tab delete Everything we need to delete everything here and then create just hit that new new there and apply you need, you need to repartition because it's very small only 32 gig <coughs> and then that's it guys that's it will start to uh, click uh, the this one enter now it will start to install the operating system so that's pretty simple guys you know I've been uh, trying to uh, analyze this for how many hours but after some research I, I I I find out that it only supports Windows 10 32 bit. Maybe it will support 32 bit um, Windows 8, but uh, I prefer Windows 10. So after that, we need to reinstall drivers, and everything will be fine. You know that. You know what I'm saying? Good. <coughs> so. That's it guys, I will update you later after the installation is finished. So device now is getting ready. United States, yes. Right on the setup screen, guys. It's finished. Yes, for the US, skip. Skip for now. Use tabs. password no password just next we can use that yes or no except that's it guys almost done after that uh, you need to configure drivers download application so that's it guys that's the technique there you have to um, install uh, operating system Windows 10 32 bit and turn off secure boot so it will display in the boot section and that's all straightforward so that's it guys there's no mouse but there is keyboard here you can use um, external mouse also to configure and there you can have a, you can have install drivers so that's all for today guys so you have to find the drivers there to work and um, that's all for now thank you for watching